What's up guys, JA Monster Energy here bringing you a updated video of the Red Snow Jailbreak. So I, I've been getting a bunch of messages and emails saying, oh you didn't explain it correctly, um, can you help me out, I still, have a, I still didn't understand it or whatever. Okay, so I'm going to do the, like, try to make it better. So first of all, you're going to need to download two, uh, two things. One, the Red Snow, the link is going to be in the description below. And two, your device's 4.0 firmware. Okay, so this will not work on iPod Touch 3G, iPod Touch MC model. You can check this by going into Settings, General, and About. If it's a MC model, you're out of luck, buddy. And this will not work on iPhone 3GS unless it is a old boot ROM. Or unless it's not a MC model again. So, um, first of all, you're going to need to update your iPod Touch to 4.0. And um, Apple just released a new, what's it called? A new firmware, so be careful you don't update to 4.1 because there is no jailbreak available for that. So this just recognized my iPod Touch. And you are, okay, it's, it still says 4.0.2. So just hit update if you're still on 4.0 and restore if you're already on 4 or 4.0.2 because it's better that you have a fresh restored iPod. You could have a problem if you're not restored or freshly restored. Okay, so once it's on 4.0.2, I'm not going to update my iPod because I already have a bunch of stuff and I'm lazy to put it on. So after it's on 4.0.2, you're going to open up Red Snow again. Link in the description below, and that's why you're gonna That's why you needed the 4.0 firmware. You're gonna hit Browse and 4.0, not 4.0.2, because it would say unable to recognize. All right, guys, and it should say, "Is this a new fixed model for the iPod Touch?" Hit No, and hit Next. All right, it's gonna do its patching stuff, and if it's um, if it stays in waiting for a reboot the process, uh, maybe you're on an MC model, so don't be putting a comment. Oh, it's stuck on reboot. I don't know how to fix that. It might be an MC model. Okay, so if you want multitasking, home screen and battery percent, just leave them on. If not, you just select it. Leave the defaults. I recommend it unless you want a custom boot logo like I did on my previous video. So just enable, 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 in studio. Hit next. Make sure your device is both off and plugged in. So you're going to turn off your iPod Touch or iPhone and plug it in and make sure it's plugged in and then hit next. Uh, let the process go or do the process that it tells you hold on power like of the power and then keep your home button pressed for 30 seconds and after that it's gonna um, do the jailbreaking by itself so you just leave your iPod touch sitting down or laying on the table whatever go get yourself a cocoa or something uh, a coffee come back and then you're jailbroken I hope this video or update helped. If um, you're still having problems, I have a Skype special for, what's it called? Special for just Skype help. So right now if I open my help one, it's probably going to say like 50,000 people are going to add me. So my name is JA Monster Energy on Skype. And as you can see there, I have a crap load of people. So just add me and I'll try to help you as much as I can. I hope this video helped again. Um, I'll see you guys soon. And remember to hit the subscribe button above. See you guys.